just uh, received the Hong Kong Models 1 to 48 scale B17. So the B17 here, Hong Kong Models are better known for the 30 second scale uh, models which are very huge. Now the B17G here was very well received last year and then they've shrunk it and they've made the 148 version. So the box looks pretty small but it's jam-packed full of stuff. So let's have a quick look and we'll just compare the sizes to see so you have an idea of what it's like. Okay, so when you talk about fuselages, just to give you an idea. So it's a little bit smaller, it's easier to handle because I guess a lot of people that are collecting these now are finding it hard to find space for. What do you do with it? Well, I mean, these come with a wall hanger, so you can actually build them, and the wall hanger comes underneath, and you mount them on the wall like so. But if you do have room, the 48 scale fits a lot better. Let's see you there. Few slides. And let's compare the wings. So you can give an idea. Now, obviously, the, the detail is very similar to the 30 second scale one, but it does have less parts, obviously, because it's smaller. But one of the more impressive things, and we'll get into it more detail later, is how nice the surface detail is. See all those really fine rivets? And they're quite deep, so once you put a wash over them, they'll pop out really well. So there you go, there's my first look at a, uh, the 48 scale Hong Kong model B17, as compared to 30 second scale B17. Both very nice kits, but tough space or time to build. Good choice. Mm -hmm.